Well, hello again. It's been a really fucking long while, but, you know, I guess alongside what I'm going to show you in this video, I guess I should kind of update you on a few things that's been kind of going on in my lifetime here these past couple of months. But, um, as the title of the video of this would, uh, would suggest, I do have a couple of interesting, interesting things. I can't English already. I have a couple of interesting things to show you, and this uh, my Poseidon model being one of them, and the next grand reveal coming on sometime here in a few minutes. But, you know, before I jump to that, I kind of figured I'd enlighten you on a few things. So these past couple of months I've been working six days a week, ten hour days, so I've only been getting Sundays off, and only getting one day off doesn't really allow me much time to put together videos and stuff like that. And also, I should tell you that if you're wondering if there's anything new that's been going on with the Super Cruise Ship Project, if I'm being brutally honest, I actually have not touched this thing in a couple of months because I've kind of lost my edge whenever it comes to Minecraft. I play other games, I do other things, and I got stuff to do and all that crap, so the Super Cruise Ship hasn't really gotten all that far. So, besides that, I've actually been kind of putting together a little bit more work on the Poseidon over here because... Yes, it is a very interesting ship, and it's a very hard ship to replicate, and I am very satisfied with the model that I got here, and also I'm going to be using it in a challenge that a friend of mine started up with a couple of other friends of his, putting together some ocean liners, and you can probably expect a video about that popping up sometime soon, around the beginning of December. But, you know, and kind of going back on my little 50 second teaser video, you know, showcasing my MS Poseidon build, Somebody did shoot the uh, recommendation my way of trying to put together an interior on this thing, and I've actually been kind of doing that. I've got a couple of the compartments up front filled in, ready to go. All the cabins are in place and ready to go. Now I just gotta take tidbits from the movie and figure out where the atrium goes, or the lobby, and figure out where the main ballroom goes, and then I can just kind of make a custom slate as to what the hell I want to add to the ship because there are no schematics showing what the actual floor plans or deck plans or interior layouts of the inside of the ship were. So anybody could build the ship and get away with making their own custom interior and they're not wrong, but they're not right. So it's just all like, do whatever the hell you want to do with it. So for the most part, I've been detailing the Poseidon a lot more. It's probably gonna go down as being like my number two tool. Yeah, I was gonna try to say number my number two jewel. <laughs> You know, kind of like alongside my Super Cruise Ship project, this Poseidon model of mine is going to be my next best thing in my entire fleet. And I've been doing more detail work on it, and actually I'm going to switch this to night time, because the Poseidon looks a lot more interesting at night. I still need to get all the cabins lit up and all that stuff, and for the most part, you know, all the interior work is going to be coming on later on down the road. So it really hasn't changed all that much, except for a couple of bushes, some scaffolding, and some wiring going from here to there, putting like the, uh those chains of lights that they had hanging around all over the place. So for the most part, that kind of tells you what I've been doing for the past little bits that I've been playing Minecraft here and there. But um, what I'm getting ready to show to you next is probably going to be a love me, hate me kind of thing. And the reason why I say that is because most of my uh, subscribers and most of my videos have always consisted of me playing Minecraft, building ships, and also my big super cruise ship build, which a lot of people have already come to know and love and have, you know, praised it, loved it, hate it, you know, say what you want, what, say what you want about it. I've even had some people tell me it's just a gigantic waste of time. And the fact that you might, uh, well, yeah, okay, so the fact that I say that it's going to be a love me, hate me kind of thing be is because what I'm getting ready to show to you is going to be something either great or something stupid, but I'm going to leave it up to you to decide on that. And the golden moment being... This, ladies and gentlemen, is probably going to be the last biggest ship that I'm ever going to create. And yes, believe it or not, I am now attempting to surpass my previous record of my world's largest cruise ship ever built on Minecraft PS4. This son of a bitch is so damn big that you can't even really get it to fit into a single render distance. And the culmination of this little project of mine was all started because a certain friend of mine claimed that he was going to try to beat my record of my previous ship by only a couple of blocks, and I was all like, nope, can't have that. So, it's, so in a little bit of secrecy, but though everybody already knows it now, 
I've been working, I've been putting together the skeletal frame of this ship, which I am probably going to rip off the movie Wally and call it the Axiom for being like, you know, the next biggest ship. And I think I actually have a little bit of a diagram of it here saved. The dimensions of the ship are going to be a bit, um, oh, what's the word I'm thinking about? Or thinking of, thinking about. Okay, yeah, so the, yeah, the dimensions of this ship are going to be a little bit, you know, disclosed, disclosed information, so people can't really try to know what to beat. But for the most part, it's probably going to get a little bit longer and a little bit wider, even though I've only got just like a base layout of what the entire ship is going to look like. The entire front end of it, I've got it all put together, and it is definitely bigger than my previous ship by country mile. And... For the most part, I'm probably not going to do any interior on this whatsoever. It's probably just going to be an exterior thing only, just to ha so I can say that I've built a ship bigger than mine. And I am kind of cheating the system, because if you kind of look right here, you see the open wide junction between the two superstructures? This ship is going to have a twin-slash-split superstructure assembly, and the big square, or the big open spot here in the middle, is going to be kind of like a direct descendant to the main garden area from my previous super cruise ship build. So, for the most part, this is going to be the last biggest ship I ever create. It's probably going to get bigger than this as I work down, you know, as I work towards the end of the ship. And, yeah, this is where I say it's going to be a love-me-hate-me -me kind of thing, because doing this, a lot of people are going to be thinking, well, was... Was everything you did with the previous Super Cruise Ship build and just going to be lost and forgotten? No, not entirely, because I'm going to still try to put together some kind of an interior on my bigger and on my smaller Super Cruise Ship. And this thing's going to just be like an exterior model just to show that, hey, I built a ship even bigger. And it's probably going to take, you know, somebody else a few years to build a ship even bigger than this. You can't even really get any bigger, because if you think about it, um, the top of this little tower here, that's the sky barrier. I can't build any higher than that. And this thing has already got more decks, it's already wider, it's already longer and taller and all that good stuff, so it's definitely bigger. <laughs> it's probably going to going to be the biggest ever. <laughs> um, how many decks does it have? I'm not entirely sure. It has more than the previous ship, and it's just bigger than my other ship in any way, shape, or form. So, yeah, for the most part, this ship's going to be here. My super... Uh, my smaller ship's going to get some work done to it. But for the most part, I've been kind of putting together this thing for the past couple of months, and, you know, my work schedule's just been kind of screwing with my available time frame to get videos out. But luckily enough, with it being Thanksgiving, you know, and also, Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Now that it's Thanksgiving, we actually have a four-day weekend, so now I actually have a little bit of time to edit some stuff, put together some videos, and get something out, just to kind of, you know, let people know that, hey... I'm not dead, though I almost did die. That's a story for another day. But yeah, so just so you know, I'm not I'm not gone, I'm not dead, I haven't dropped YouTube and I haven't completely forgotten about anything. I've been doing some stuff, I've been playing some other games and all that good stuff, so you know, it's safe to say that I'm still around, I'm still doing stuff, probably not nearly as much as I used to compared to all the other videos I've ever made on YouTube and about Minecraft, but for the most part, here you have it. My next biggest project, and so hopefully to be my my solidified attempt at the world's largest ship ever built on Minecraft PS4. So with all that out of the way, yeah, it's kind of a you know a hard rock to swallow if I'm saying that correctly, but um, you know it's been a long time and I haven't really uploaded any videos in a while and now I'm starting to sound all sentimental and stuff, but you know. It's safe to say that I'm still around, I'm still doing stuff, and, you know, building a bigger cruise ship than my current super cruise ship's probably going to be a bit, eh, going to have a, a, a lot of mixed emotions from probably a good handful of people, but, but besides the super cruise ship and my Poseidon model sitting over here, my big-ass super cruise ship, I'm still alive and well, I'm still kicking, I'm still doing stuff on Minecraft, not nearly as much as I used to be, but... I'm still doing stuff, so it's not to say that I've given up on YouTube, though this whole FTC and Copa crap that's popping up next year is probably going to ruin a lot of shit. But, with that out of the way, you know, it's, you know, I'm, I'm still doing stuff, so I've been rambling on just a little bit too long, so I guess you can, can kind of consider this video being nothing more than just an update video, kind of telling you like, hey, I'm still around. So, you know, as my typical, 
typical outro would go. I've said it before, and I shall say it again. You take care. Have yourself a nice day. I'll try to upload more stuff a little bit more frequently. Don't do anything stupid. Stay alive, and I'll see you some other time.